I will be giving you guys the 10 best loadouts to rock as of right now for Rebirth Island. Listen, man, Rebirth is finally back, and I got 10 of the best loadouts that you guys should be rocking if you guys want to drop high kills on this map. All right, man, coming up as the first loadout we got right here is the MCW, and in my professional opinion, bro, this is definitely the number one AR to rock as of right now at Rebirth Island. Not only does this gun just don't move at all whatsoever, but it's damaged, bro. It is super good. But however, though, man, here's a class that you guys need for it. Start with that optic I am rocking is the Niner model 2020 23 but if you guys want to you guys can of of course obviously rock the jack glasses optic and that is also pretty good however it's really really up to you my personal opinion bro i like the jack glasses and i like the Niner model both of those work out for you okay but muscle man we are rocking is the zh mn 35 compensated flash hider for attachments for the underbarrel we are rocking is the brewing the heavy support group and that last tattoo which is for the magazine we are rocking is the 60 round drum okay now listen man if you guys just look in the fire range real quick bro dog just look at this gun just just look at it this gun it literally looks like you have a Cronus while using this MCW. But however, though, man, try out this build, bro. Just because, like I said again, bro, this thing is definitely the um, new number one AR. Now, for the second loadout, man, we got right here is the Ace 13 Auto, which is from the MW2 era. And, dog, this is this guy right here is Loki slept on. You really do not see anybody really just use this at all whatsoever. However, bro, we pretty much call this thing a Glock with a switch in a way. I'm going to make a video with this on my second channel, bro. The link will be down in the description box just in case you guys want to see that video when it does drop but however though bro this gun is very very crazy most close race gun fights but however though man he already tasked before we start with that muzzle i am rocking the xa gf90 flash hider gives us recoil steadiness muzzle flash concealment and also man for our second task which for the barrel we rock is the xrk sidewinder six slide and this gives us recoil control but velocity gun kick control third task man is for the ammunition i am rocking is the uh nine millimeter high grain rounds which gives us but velocity and damage at range and also man for the fourth task which is for the magazine we are rocking this the 50 round drum and that last test which for the rear grip we are rocking the amtac oz grip and this gives us gun kick control and recoil control okay dog like i said bro try this um built man for the x13 autos bro this thing is very very good you know it's close range gunfights this is kind of like a horrible um example to showcase because in this gunfights right here it's kind of middle but when you guys just use this gun in those uh close range gunfights Guys, you guys see how quick this thing just shoots, bro. And up close, bro, this thing literally just beats any type of secondary when it comes out of time to kill. Now, for our third loadout, man, we got right here is the Holger 556. And I'm not going to lie to you guys, this thing was going to be the, be the meta, like, not too long ago. But a lot of guns just got um, pretty much just moved up to the point where it was a little bit better. That, to the point where it was a little bit better than the Holger 556. In my personal opinion, the Holger is still good. The only thing that I can really just say is that its downfall is just its magazine because you are only getting 40 and this thing came with a 60 this thing will really just be crazy but however though man here's the class to the four start with that muzzle we are rocking z cast's break gives you horizontal recoil and fire and instability second attachment is for the barrel we are rocking this the creo six match gives you good kick control recoil control and bullet in range third attachment for the under barrel we are rocking this the brewing heavy support grip and fourth attachment which for the magazine we are rocking this the 40 round mag and that last attachment of course man which is for the optic we are rocking this the jack glasses optic and this gives you precision precision sight picture and also find my aim and stability by far the best visibility out of any optic in my personal opinion so that's why i rock it okay and dog if you guys just use just use thing in fire range bro just look at it not only does it hit hard but but it's super accurate bro i really love this thing for the fourth floor we got right here is the hrm9 even though this thing did get a little bit of nerf you guys already know you guys should be aware now warzone slash call of duty they do not know how to nerf guns properly they, they really don't so however bro this thing is still good if you guys want to use it you guys still can it still goes crazy okay but muscle man we are rocking is the zh mn35 composite flash hider second attachment for the barrel we are rocking is the thorn 90 barrel third attachment for the dr6 hand stop fourth attachment for the magazine 50 round drum and for the fifth attachment, which is for the stock, we are rocking is the hatchet light stock, and this gives you a lot of mobility out your gun. Okay, now I know a lot of people rock their HR9 builds, um, just, just simply just based off just straight mobility. But if you guys look at my build, not only is it like a little bit more accurate in those medium range gunfights, but it's also like pretty stable. So if you guys are a good player, whatever, you'll pretty much just be able to like use this, um, 
comfortably, bro. In those medium range gunfights, this thing is really good, and also it has very, very good, um, pretty much mobility. So you guys are not losing out anything. So not only do you have uh pretty much great Rico Cho, but you also have very, very good mobility. 45th loadout we got right here is the WSP9, and with this class setup, bro, it's kind of a little bit the same. I'm pretty sure you guys are seeing the patterns on how I use my SMGs. Um, with that muzzle, the Z8 is by far the best muzzle to rock on any gun basically in this in my personal opinion like the smgs and the ars in some cases but however bro this is one build that i like using the most uh with this muzzle right here the zh mn35 composition flash slider and also made for your safe attachment for your barrel we are rocking this the wsp reckless 90 long barrel and the reason for that is because i want to be able to use this gun in those medium range gun fights just in case i run out of ammo somehow uh with my uh primary gun so rocking this right here is super accurate along with that bro you keep your damage at range with it so that's why i rock it okay Third attachment for the underbarrel DR6 handstop for the mobility. Uh, fourth attachment for the magazine. We are rocking the 50 round mag. And that last test was for the stock. I am rocking this the WSP uh, class factor stock because this gives you even more gun kick control and recoil control. Or if you want to switch it out a little bit, you guys can also get away rocking the uh, WSP factory stock. Okay, listen, man, try the settlement for the WSP 9, aka the Milano that you guys seen in yesterday's video, bro. This thing is really, really good. It is super accurate, bro. It's super powerful for those close range gunfights. It's still a dominant weapon that nobody really just uses that much because everybody's just pretty much just stuck on the uh, HRM 9. And I and I respect that in a way just because the HRM 9 is a quicker time to kill SMG, especially when it comes down to the close range gunfight. But you guys can't sleep on a WSP 9, bro. This thing is still valid. Now, for the next little bro, this is kind of a car 98K build just because I pretty much just built it all straight mobility and I want this thing to have a quick, quick scoping, bro. Just like back in the day, how it was on Rebirth Island. So, if you guys want to, bro, you guys can go crazy with this class that's broke right, right here, okay? But going over, going to the first test, which for the barrel, I am recognize the handler LKP short barrel. It gives you aim down sight speed, move speed, speed to fire speed, and the crash movement speed. Second attachment for the laser, we are recognize the FWSOV laser. So we are getting a quick spit to fire speed and quick aim down sight speed. Third attachment for the stock, we got the no stock attachment, and this gives and this just gives you a lot of mobility out your gun. Uh, for test for the stock, uh, for the bolt, uh, we are recognize the XRK stock light bolt because it's pretty much is made to where you got a retraining speed um pretty much and uh last test before the rear grip we are rocking is the xrk stalker uh factory grip okay and this gives you spit the fire speed and a downside speed all right and dog if you guys want to use this class up in the fire range that you guys see this thing has a quick quick like just quick aim to just aim bro it really do this thing is really good i, I love it like a lot bro it, it, this thing is by far like my favorite sniper to use i just plenty of 40 kill gameplays using the exact car 98k build so you guys should obviously try it too now 47 lot a little bit of an og uh throwback m4 build from rebirth island guys man the m4 is crazy and a lot of people still don't use this gun for whatever reason bro this thing is crazy and i feel like this thing will also just take over rebirth island okay but going with the first task which for the muzzle we are right is the casus break it gives you horizontal recoil and fire minimum stability second attachment for the barrel we are right is the high tower 20 inch barrel and this gives you blood flies and range we're going to Hit fire accuracy. Third attachment for the underbarrel. We are rocking the Bruin heavy support grip. It will just give you five minutes ability, horizontal recoil, aim out of sway, and also gun kick control. And um, pretty much uh for the barrel, go ahead and rock that high tower 20 inch barrel optic. Um, jack glasses optic by far the best one to rock for the M4. I know some people do not rock an iron sight. Uh, not iron sight. I know some people do not rock an optic M4. But however, me, just so I don't get the best visibility in those long range gunfights, I highly recommend you guys using it. Okay. That last attachment, of course, man, which is 40 magazine we are against the 60 round mag okay and also guys by the way bro if you guys do not do not want to rot the um cast's break it's really up to you it's really just how the person is it's really all about the player if you guys do not like the cast's break another class up that i do recommend you guys trying now is the zh mn35 commissary flash hider and i'm gonna show you guys real quick in the fire range uh this thing right here just look at it don't, don't mind the damage don't don't get run don't mind the damage Overall, the M4 is definitely not a bad choice when it comes down to like those primary guns or low range guns because this thing is still like super accurate in my personal opinion. But however, though, man, let's go ahead and move on to the next loadout. Now, for the eighth loadout, we got right here is the SOA Subverter, and this is the new upcoming battle rifle that just got released, and everybody is still sleeping on, bro. This thing is crazy, and I just know that this thing will take over Rebirth Island for sure. But however, though, man, going to this battle rifle real quick, the class of the four, start with the optic. Go ahead, rock that jack glasses optic for that visibility. Some people rock the iron sight SOA Subverter, me personally. 
I am not a big fan of it. So that's why I'm rocking this optic in particular. Uh, second attachment for the barrel. We are on the Dozer 90 long barrel. And just look at those stats real quick. You're getting an extra build velocity and range, extra five minutes stability, gun kick control, and also recoil control. So you're just going to be a complete just beam while using this gun, okay? Um, third test man for the muzzle ZH M35 comes to the fly hider, or if you guys want to, you guys can always rock the um Cassis break or even the, the um the JBB, which I see some people rock. But however, man, I am sticking to my ZH M35 comes to fly hider because it works out for me. Okay, go ahead and try this build off if you guys um need to. Okay, and on the barrel, man, we are rocking this the Bruin heavy support grip. And at last test which is for the magazine, we got right here is the 50 round drum. Okay, and guys, man, let's go ahead and just take a look at this thing real quick at the fire range. Just look at it. Just look at it. It's, it's literally. Not only does this thing shoot very, very fast, but however, once you guys get to those close range and medium range, and then once that long range hit, I ain't gonna lie to you, it is a little bit kind of hard just to keep up with it just slightly. But however, though, bro, this thing shoots very, very quick, bro. It is, this thing is very, very dominant, bro. I will say to you guys, bro, try it out, bro, and let me know in the comment section uh, how you guys feel about this. However, though, bro, this thing could definitely take over Rebirth. Now, for my ninth loadout, I see a lot of people sleep on this Bruin MK9 build for whatever reason. This thing is crazy still, but a lot of people just don't use it no more. However, though, bro, here's the class of the four. Optic Jack Glasses Optic for the barrel 23-inch SRK Horizon V2 because this is the biggest barrel to rock for it. Third attachment for the muzzle we are rocking as the cast's break for attachment for the underbarrel we are rocking as the brewing heavy support grip which gives you even more gun control and miles away horizontal recoil and also fire instability and last attachment for the magazine we are rocking as the 60 round mag okay and guys man look at this thing in the fire range real quick yes this thing only has a 60 round mag but however bro just look at it just just look at it oh do you guys see how accurate this thing is, bro? If you guys are not using the Bruin MK9 after the update, bro, you're simply just missing out. And for the final loadout we got right here is the Ram 9 Dog, bro. This thing is still good. Like I said, bro, the H Ram 9 and the WSP9 and my present pair are definitely in my uh, top three. But, dog, this build right here for the Ram 9, bro, it definitely competes with the R with the R with the H R M 9, bro. I'm not even kidding with you. However, though, bro, here's the build for it, man, just so you guys can try to stay out on Rebirth. Muscle L4R Flash Hider. Um, second attachment, uh, what you guys want to rock is the Underbarrel DR6 Hand Stop. Third attachment, Magazine, 50 Round Drum. Or testament rigor retort 90 grip tape gives you rear control gun control if i maybe stability last testament is the stock and we are rocking it is the ultra like stock pad is this will give you a walk speed move speed and uh sprint speed okay of course all right dog try this book man for the uh round nine this thing is super quick you guys see the mobility as i am in the fire range and not only does this thing just just have crazy mobility this thing hits and it's very very stable when it comes down to those close range gun fights it shoots very very fast bro try this build man but however though man if you guys just did happen to enjoy today's video i highly recommend you guys go ahead and hit that like button bro go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you guys are new and listen man i like you guys all so much and my boys peace all right here what the hell the audio is so damn low I do not care about y'all, bro. That's still be crazy if you get like a severe to hit a hundred K. I hope these guys not being so weird, bro. Please don't be weird. Why would you chow that? Because I wanted to. Yeah, he got he got put six feet too for trying that. Come on, bro. He said, yeah, I can't beat him by myself. Why are you yelling downstairs? Oh, no. Let's go. Oh, this is a part two. Only 25 remain. Yeah, you talking about? I missed that. Try that round nine. Nah, round nine still feels hella good though. 
Say what? Ooh, yeah, I bought the um, I bought out the store. No, I do not. You no, I don't got it. What are, you, what are you doing with your life? Shit, not going for that shit. Yeah, you're weird. Oh, sniper, sniper. The rest thank you, man. Thank you, man. Why are you telling me good snipe? Isn't it your gameplay? What the hell? I was talking to myself. You right? Enemies Wait, are dropping who am I getting sniped? I'm getting sniped by two people. Blood eyes here, finally. Oh. Oh, that, was it a camo? I think it was the uh, magma camo. Mr. Cocker Wang, yo. Yo, he been a Come on, get me back in there. Game. He's rising. What is he doing? What are y'all doing, bro? Okay, Let me hold some, bro. Oh, what? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Come on, bro. Quit saying that, bro. You're a grown man saying that. Oh, my God. My friend group, bro. When people landed down there, bro. That, why are you down there? No. <laughs> What is he doing? Is he still alive? Huh? Talking about stunning. Why is he rocking the bullet? Cause I don't know what's the rock. But nah, this thing is pretty good though. Oh, he's, nuts. He just, he's trying not to die, bro. <laughs> oh my god. So y'all are choosing to be weird. Oh, get my head stuck on the thing. He said, stay alive. I got you, bro. I got you, bro. Let you have it. Oh, you say you, you, you gonna give me half the revenue? How do, how do, how do I get up here? Oh. I don't care about that counter. They ain't stopping nothing. Damn, how the hell did I miss that? Thank you, bro. <laughs> that shit gonna get into bully game the way you know. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro, he threw that shit off the map, bro. No way I lost that fight, bro. I lied. <laughs> bro, legend, he's still here. Oh my god, I almost lost that somehow. Oh, that poor Brad not gonna come in clutch. Don't tell me he got my guns, bro. Let's see him. I just can't wait to. I can't wait to use that new gun. Parking the rest of that squad on your tag. Talk. Go get hunting. Fire sale active. Buy station. Where's he at? Oh, he's in the sky. Oh, no. Oh, they just. They're running around. I don't even know who's shooting, bro. Why is everybody just running away? Enemies are dropping into the area. Watch the skies. Sit, sit down. I know. This guy's actually pretty decent. He's probably a decent player so far at the game. You have a buy station inbound. I'm cheating. Nope, I am not cheating, my brother. We all know you get the worst lobbies in here. Who do the name my Cardi? Oh, bro. Oh, bro, like, where can you possibly see me at? You got gas moving in. 
fuck out looking for. Where the hell is this guy at? Underneath me, nobody's moving. Yo, find him, sonny, down. Yo, try not to. There you go. Marking the rest of that squad on your attack map. Get hunting. The visibility sucks, bro. It, it generally is. Oh, shit. To know where the hell no guy why are these why are these guys running with each other what like why y'all running with each other first they'll reap up y'all are running with each other <laughs> 